It is the largest art heist in U.S. history, the Isabella Stewart Gardner theft. And now with a looming deadline for a big reward, there's hope for a big break. It's WBC's Mike LaCrosse reports in the last minute. Biggest private reward ever offered. And it's about to expire. The $10 million reward dropping to $5 million January 1st. But what we're looking for are facts. We're looking for people who can tell us where we can go get our paintings. 13 pieces, including works by Rembrandt, Degas, Manet, and Vermeer, all swiped from the Isabella Stewart Gardner Museum by two thieves dressed as cops in the early morning hours of March 18, 1990. It's the biggest property theft in the history of man. Anthony Amore, the museum's director of security, still optimistic 27 years after the heist. History has shown um, that when paintings are stolen, they stay pretty close. Tucked away under a bed in a basement or attic, waiting to be found. Until then, the masterpiece's frames remain hanging empty. It's a message to the public that we're never going to forget these paintings. There's only one place they belong, and that's here in Mrs. Gardner's collection. Amore says he'll have his cell phone on loud by his side right up until 11:59, 59 Sunday night when that reward expires, but he says he'll never stop looking for those paintings. Reporting in Boston, I'm Mike LaCrosse, WBZ News.